What is going on guys, Aim the Shame here, back with another Pink Slips. This time, we are going to be doing Inform Hulk. The, P the Twitter name of the guy I'm playing is called Wager to Recover, and his PS name is RNTM underscore zero zero. So as you see guys, let's take a look at Inform Hulk stats. I paid 233k for him, 91 pace, 89 shooting, 85 dribbling, and 79 passing, with 76 heading. All round, some great stats there, and he is one of the best strikers I have used on FIFA. So, I've gone for a 3-5-2 very overpowered Brazilian squad there. I know there's not one player in this squad which isn't very good. They're all so absolute, well, they're just quality players which will win you games. This guy had a, a mostly League 1 squad with a few Premier League players going on here. And uh, quite a nice squad, quite a pacey one. But overall, I've seen a lot more scary squads than that in my time on FIFA. But as you see, guys, this game was very laggy. And I'm going to make a rule from now on, guys. It, like, it's very hard for me to say this, but when I'm doing games and if they get very laggy, I'm going to have to just quit the game. Unless you're winning, I'm not going to do it then. But if it's a draw or even I'm winning and I feel like it's an appropriate time, I will quit the game, guys. If it's too laggy, well, I mean, like, too laggy, I don't mean little bit of lag I can bear a little bit but I mean kind of like you will see in a minute this was unplayable when you constantly like every attack you can kind of you're stopping every other every other like time you touch the ball then I'm gonna like kind of this is kind of okay at the moment but in a minute like now if it's like this all the time I'm gonna have to probably disconnect just because I, I kind of make these pink slips for entertaining videos and the ball is stopping all the time and like that it's just this is very tedious to watch so I'm not gonna do them in the future if I get into the game and the latency is red there's a high chance I'm going to quit the game so apologies for that guys but let's look at this it's very hard to play I didn't do it this game because I never told you about this rule before but in future I may just have to do that so uh uh, the reason why it's hard for me to do that is because when I pick people for pink slips, they get so happy and so pleased. It's hard for me then to say, sorry, I don't want to play you now. The connection's too bad. But anyway, this game I battled it out and I still managed to score a few goals. I'm now 4-0 up on the 72nd minute, going very well. Look like I will keep in form Hulk. And as you guys will see, I now start to win. I, I win a penalty from this corner. As you see, David Luiz, for some reason, takes a corner, even though he should be in there. Dede goes for the shot and does get saved. Santana gets tackled. Enrique gets the ball does some advance to it and then goes back inside the box and uh, eventually wins me a penalty so what I actually usually do for my penalties is take it with my keeper but for this time I thought you know I don't know if that's a cheesy thing to do or a cheeky thing to do it's kind of like it's not that hard to score a penalty with your keeper so I decided to use David Luiz but he actually missed it so we ended up winning the game 4-0 though guys thank you for watching please leave a like rating and there will be either two videos tomorrow or one video later thank you guys for watching